Hello my beautiful love bugs and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, as you can tell from the setup, we're doing a fashion haul. I am so excited because fashion is my favorite type of video to film. You already know this. Anyway, for today I am sharing with you guys my spring picks from a new to me website called bombposh.com. But they have some really, really cute stuff so I wanted to just pick some things out, see how it fits, see how the quality was, and share it with you guys. Also, shout out to Bomb Posh for hooking it up with a 25% off discount for you guys, which is really, really generous. It's just Rocio L25, and I will leave that information for you guys down below as well. So, without further ado, and as always, we are going to start with what I am currently wearing, which is this sweatshirt. Anywho, it is this very wide open neckline, and it looks almost like it was just torn. It's not like a super Super finished edge which I really really like you could wear this guy like off one shoulder or you know off both shoulders however you prefer the sleeves are also like this three-quarter situation and I like to just roll it up a little bit just right above the elbow for a little bit more bulk and bulge over here especially on the off the shoulder side it says bake so I mean come on it's like it's just really cute I just saw this and I was like that's an Instagram worthy top and that's really the reason why I wanted it at least I'm honest guys right so I just thought it was really cute and I like the rip along and I'm eating hair so it is a little bit longer on the sides as you guys can see and it comes up on the top in the center I mean um for a really nice cropped effect while still being loose and baggy and just movement and comfortable. Alright, so next I want to grab this guy. You guys know that I do jump around a little bit. I'll try to go like in order this time around. I just wanted to jump to this guy first because on the website I actually saw this paired together with the top and I just love the way the outfit looked together so much that I'm like, okay, I'm gonna get both. I love the bright, vibrant blue color of this skirt and I like the tie-up sides for a little bit of skin action but nothing too crazy. I also like that the tie-up sides are like, they're just there. Like, it's part of the thing. There's not actually a knot that you have to tie or a bow that you have to tie. So this is the design. You don't have to worry about it opening up or tightening it or tying it or whatever. This thing looks so tiny when I saw it. I was like, whoa. But it has like the nicest stretch ever, thankfully. And it's just a really, really nice color. It looks like a denim, but it's just a blue color, but it has kind of like that denim feel, um, which I really liked. And it has a nice uh, exposed zipper in the back. Kind of wish that the zipper and the little ring hardware was gold just because I always wear gold jewelry but it's okay. It's still cute. The first dress that I have here that just went plummeting to the ground. This guy is so orange. I love it. Whoa guys. It's super super bright. Even the yellows which is more of like a diluted color in this particular design. It's very bright. It's like a very bright light yellow, if that makes sense. But this orange is just like on fire. Material like this tends to mark every little inch and nook and cranny of your body. Um, it's very body hugging and clingy, which obviously like I knew this material was going to be like that. But when items are not lined inside, it can be a little bit transparent and just a little bit too clingy. So I like that this is fully lined all the way from top to bottom. So I loved this guy for the vibrant colors. The print is also super, super beautiful. I am an absolute sucker for a good denim dress. This is just beautiful. It is a spaghetti strap situation going on here. And I also like, all right, my like it was this is a bad view, <laughs> or maybe not. Maybe it's cool. <laughs> I also like that it has kind of like the um, seams along the cup, so it looks kind of like a sweetheart neckline. I really, really love that. The day that I get married, I will have a sweetheart neckline as my wedding dress. It does have the overall shape, and again, the seams and stuff just add a nice little extra. This guy is a little bit of a mini dress, but the jean material is super stretchy, and it's going to do a great job at hiding um, any flaws, any little areas, any chichitos that you have. In case you have no idea what I'm talking about, chichos are, or chichitos as I call them, are like the little bits of fat that you have that like always stick out and bother you. So any little areas or little rolls, I guess would be the English word for it, right? Like your little rolls. 
Um, but those are the chichitos. So <laughs> denim dresses do a really, really nice job of just smoothing out your body and like hiding all those little chichitos. So hashtag say no to the chichos in the comments right now. I don't know why, but just go do it. <laughs> this two-piece set, first of all, I still love two-piece uh, matching separates. I think I always will love them. It's like infinite possibilities type of situation. So this one right here, I liked it because I just got like Barbie doll vibes. It's this beautiful blush pink color and it does have like this shimmery material throughout. So it is a halter. It's got like padding over here so you're not going to see through the material. It's nice and thick. When the girls randomly want to say hi or like if you get a little bit too cold and stuff like that, it's not going to show through this material. And it does have a thicker band along the bottom. Then it also has like this extra, so the band does go all the way around, but it also has this extra stringy situation going on where you can do like a crisscross around your waist, which looks really, really cute. The one thing that I did want to say about the skirt, however, is that this guy is not lined, so it is a lighter color and it's not lined. I feel like it's a little bit more on the see-through side. You guys can even see my hand right there. So with something like this, I would definitely opt for a full bottom um, underwear situation. Maybe like a little bikini bottom shaped underwear in a nude color or a color that matches my skin tone. So moving right along, I have another dress right here for you guys. Again, super, super different and say it with me guys, visually interesting. I don't think there is a fashion video where I don't say this word. And this guy is definitely like, it's a beautiful, gorgeous, basic shape. It is a spaghetti strap um, dress with a nice little V cut in the front, really nice top, just a bodycon style dress. And this guy is a little bit longer, it's not like a mini dress situation, so it does come to about the knees. Um, and then it has this really, really cool aspect along the sides. Clothing and dressing for your body or for the body shape you want to have is all about optical illusions. So this dress does an excellent job at that because the studding go in a manner that's going to draw the eye in at the waist and then it pulls out a little bit at the hips to make the illusion of wider hips, thicker thighs, things like that as well. Um, and that just adds the shape. Whether you've got it or not, this is gonna make you look like you have it or look like you have it even more so, accentuate it even more if you do have that hourglass shape already. So anything in clothing that can mimic the shape that you want to have, that's what you wanna look for. So with this guy, I liked the studs. I liked that they were a bigger size and they are gold. And then this area over here that's on the outside of that hourglass figure is um, perforated, so it is kind of see-through. So you're getting a little peak of skin. The next guy right here, oh, the sleeve is stuck. Come out, little guy. This dress, again, really simple um, style and design. It also has kind of a um, curved bottom as well. This is a bit of a mini dress, so it is pretty short, but the curved bottom adds a little bit more length right in the front and right in the back, as you guys will see in the try-on. Um, it is also kind of a long short sleeve, which I thought was pretty cute. I love the simple neckline and just the simplicity of this dress. And I really, really liked this mauve -y color. I thought it was really pretty for... I'm always dropping stuff. For the upcoming springtime. And something like this is more so a basic for me, even though the color isn't really a neutral. It's more of like... It's more of a color, but it's so toned down, like it's not a bright lilac or anything like that. It has like a gray tone, almost like a gray brown purple tone. Um, so it's still not a neutral, but I feel like it's easier to use as a basic piece and then build an outfit around this or on top of this. So something like this is pretty simple and it gives you a lot of room to be creative, which I really like. And finally, we have another matching separate two-piece set situation going on. This one I really, really liked because it is an olive color. I like the top. It's just a very simple um, kind of two spaghetti strap top so really easy peasy and then the bottom I liked it's a skirt but it's a little bit longer um, which I really really liked it's a high-waisted skirt and it does have a thick thicker elastic band on top which is going to do wonders at cinching in your waist and creating again that hourglass figure if you don't feel comfortable wearing something like this out on its own you can always 
pair this with like a denim on top or a full leather jacket even like a little blazer on top would be really cute so I loved the color I like the stripe ribbing effect I thought that was like a cool interest on I mean a cool distinction on just like a horizontal stripe it's got like the plain and the ribbing that adds a little bit more dimension just something extra to the look as well all right all my beautiful love bugs my bays out there thank you guys for hanging out with me today I hope you liked my selection from the bomb posh site let me know what your favorite was so yeah if you like their stuff and you like the stuff you see on their site and this is kind of your style too and want to see more in the future then let me know i'll get some hauls for you guys i'll get some looks looks books why do i always say that word wrong i'll get some look books going i love you guys and i'll see you really soon with another video bye